what the Lord can do, okay? Give her of the fruit of her hands and let her own works praise her in the gates, okay? Give her the fruits of her hands and let her own word praise her in the gates, okay? And the word of the Lord says, women, be a woman, take care of your husband, do the things a woman's supposed to do. You know, you're not the man, let him be the man. Let him raise your sons, okay? Let them raise your sons, because what I'm seeing today out here, it is not a good sign. You women have lost so much control over your children. You know, back, and I will say this, back in the 80s, it came out with social service. Uh, you need to get the man out the home, or we'll pay you. He don't need to be there, and all this and that, and you took with it and you ran with it. This is the product of the day of what we're seeing with our children. And so if we're seeing it with our children, I mean, it's going to see it with our grandchildren. We pray, Lord God, and by Satan right now in the name of Jesus, that he have no other authority over our family, over our home. Lord God, we ask you to step in right now and I bring uh, 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 relationships back in, in, the, in the home, bring relationships back in the families with husbands, with wives, with women, with men, with children, Lord God. Let the men stay, stay there and raise their own, Lord God. Let them not be thrown away or pushed aside by a woman, Lord God, who wants to do their job, but you have given them another job, which is to be the woman, take care of the home, take care of the children, take care of the husband, cook, clean, do what you have to do, and stop being lazy. And I pray for you all in Jesus' name, and may you all have a blessed day. Amen. Thank you.